Good afternoon and welcome to Norris Dog Training Company. We're here today with Disco and Fred, and we're, what we're going to be demonstrating is Disco's ability to do his formal obedience commands. We're going to take a moment to introduce the training equipment. Now the training equipment that, uh, that we have is Fred has a six foot web training leash where he's going to keep the bulk of that leash in his right hand, leaving his left hand free to give Disco a correction if he needs one at all. And a correction that we use is a little tug and let go on his training collar and that's the second piece of equipment that we're using. Now you see that Disco is seated, seated nicely to Fred's left and the first exercise that we're, that we're going to demonstrate is healing. Heel on his proper walking on a leash, and the command is Disco, heel. Now Disco has definitely come a very long way in his training, all of his housebreaking, and we, um, you know, we are definitely pleased at the way that he's come along with his training here. So now when Fred you know, walks with Disco, every time you stop, the first thing that Disco will do is sit nicely to your left to where if you're out walking him out in public, you know, once you stop, the first thing that he'll do is sit like a gentleman, you know, right to your left. So now, the second command that, that we're gonna demonstrate is the stay command. The stay command is a hand and a voice command. It's, it's your left hand straight out, about an inch or so from his muzzle, and the one word firm command to stay. Now, as a puppy, you always wanna start out, you know, with Disco holding this, his sit stays, you know, for a short, for a shorter period of time, and then always work your way up, you know, like to where he's holding it for longer and longer. But you always want to start out in a small amount of time, and then, you know, work your way up. And then when Disco comes home tomorrow, we're going to go over everything with you on how to reinforce all of his training. So when Fred comes back to Disco, he comes back to the heel position, and he praises him up, and then he takes off healing with him. Once you stop, Disco sits. Good boy, buddy. Fred leaves him in another sit stay. Walks out to, to the end of the training leash. So now this time, rather than going back to him, Fred's going to call Disco. The command is Disco come. Praise him up as he's coming in. Once he comes to you, then he sits right in front of you. Then it's back to the heel position. Every time you stop, Disco sits down very nicely. Fred leaves him in another sit stay. Fred calls him, praises him up. Once you stop, good boy, buddy. Back to healing. Once you stop, Disco's sitting. Now the next command that I'm gonna give Fred a second to set up for is the down command. Now there's two commands for the down and the one is the down from the heel position. And it's just, it's going to be with your left hand straight down towards the ground and the one word firm command to down. Everything's with your left hand, down. And then once you walk away from him, you always wanna tell him to stay. Ah, Disco got up, Fred told him no, down. back sitting, down, stay. Good. Good. If at any time, if you, give, if you give Disco a command, and if he goes to break it, first thing that you want to do is, is you want to tell him no, you know, bring him back sitting, and then finish the command. Fred comes back. So when Fred was walking back to Disco, Disco had, you know, gotten up, but it's not, it's not the end of the world. Fred's just going to heal him around. He's going to bring him back to, you know, to another sit once you stop, and then he's going to put him back down. Stay. Good boy, bud. Fred walks away from him, and then... And the thing that's key is just having Disco finish the command as he was taught. That's how he learns. Fred calls him, good boy. You always want to praise him up. You never want to make him feel like he's ever going to get in trouble, you know, for coming to you. Fred's going to demonstrate that down command again. The 
with his left hand, straight down. And all of your commands too, it'll be very good you know, to reinforce them in your home as well. Like if you guys are sitting there watching TV, you know, put them in a down stay. You know, it's where you know, he doesn't move until you allow him to. Fred gets back to him, praises him up, now we're back healing. Now, the last command that we're, that we're going to demonstrate is the only command that you use your right hand with. It's just the uh, down from the distance. So Fred leaves Disco in a sit stay. He walks out to the end of the training leash, and then with his right hand, gives him the firm command to down. If he doesn't go down the first time, tell him no, and down again. And especially, you know, for being, you know, such a young puppy that he is, he's he's done very well, you know, with all of uh, with all of his obedience. Disco did a great job here and he will be coming home tomorrow and if you guys have any other questions or anything at all feel free to give us a call. Thank you and have a good day.